Hey there everybody, it's Andre in the flow. It's day five of my 366 day challenge to let it shine online and beyond. Today we're gonna talk about internal and external warfare and how that goes and also the understanding that there is not a finite supply of love and opportunity. We just gotta keep going. Stay tuned. Oh my God, it is rainy on this beach and there's a giant rainbow behind me. Yes! Hey there everybody, it's Andre and the flow from Love City Arts. Happy fifth day of the year. It's also the start of the second week of the year. This will be the, the full week, the first full week, but it's the second week of 2020. We're already moving along. I just wanna let you know that I love you and that I support you and that I'm here for you no matter how near or far you are on the planet. Also, as cheesy as it is, happy bird day and happy whipped cream day. Hopefully those days don't go together. I like blue jays, what about you? I also like low fat whip because I'm trying to work on my beach body for the summer if you haven't heard, if you haven't been following. So yeah, happy bird day and happy whipped cream day. I also wanna leave you with a couple of thoughts today. The thoughts that I'm having is that there's not a finite supply of love and opportunity that exists on the planet. I know that the news, I know that Instagram, I know that all of these spaces will try to convince you that there's finite love, finite resources, and finite opportunities. I'm here to let you know that's not the case. We have plenty of it to go around. All you have to do is take a breath, and just receive it. Now, did that really change the amount of money in your bank account? Probably not. Did it change the amount of lovers in your bed, if that's a thing you want? <laughs> Probably not. But just feel how wonderful it feels today, on the fifth day of this year, to just realize that love is in abundance, opportunity is in abundance, self-care is in abundance, and it's only a step away from you. Also, um, destruction and war has been all in the news every day. There's some, there's some new news cycle of war, destruction and bombing and things like that that's going on. I know that there's also wars that we're having inside ourselves. You should, you should actually see the ping pong match that happens from sun up to sundown. Now the meditation helps, but there's a constant war inside me. Should I go? Should I stay? Should I have? Should I not have? I want to call myself and I want to call you back to love and to keep moving forward one micro step at a time. No pressure. Just move forward the best you can on this day in this week. Just do the best you can. I know that you're gonna have difficulties on your job. I have them on mine. I know that you're gonna have challenges in, in your interpersonal relationships. I have them in mine. I'm still trying to find my mother. <laughs> still trying to figure out what's going on professionally. But we, but we just keep moving forward. Somehow it all gets done. And we just keep moving forward. I think that that's the message of the day. Just keep going. I know we're five days in. That leaves us with math. 361 days left. Just keep moving forward. Don't slack yourself out. Don't freak yourself out. Just keep moving forward. All right. Uh, I, ha I have no quote today. I have nothing. I, I, you know, I didn't have time to find something cool on the internet. Drop me your cool quotes below. I would love to hear those. I do want to share with you though the mantra that I have for 20 uh for 2020. My word of the year with Tamisha Binky Williams is hope. We've joined forces. Let there be hope in 2020. But my mantra for the year is everything is working out for me. Say it with me. Everything is working out for me. 
and you, and you, and you. When someone starts coming into your DMs talking about what's not going well, remind them everything is working out for you. When you start freaking out about your deadlines and your waistline, everything is working out for you. Don't forget it. Don't forget it. And I'll see you tomorrow. Mwah.